Hello everyone, welcome back to the Wood Gaming YouTube channel and today we will discuss a lot of things that I have going on. At first you see me here buying the St. Peter um, skin which gives 10% infantry defense at the cost of calves and archer attack. But because I am infantry only it's 10% free stats for me which is pretty good. Then we move on to something that I discovered um, with above all King's skill from Liu Che. I have the idea that it triggers very often because we have already seen it twice. This is the third time in a row that we see the expertise skill. And on turn 7, 27 we see it for the fourth time in a row. These odds are pretty low, you can calculate it by doing 0 0.25 to the power of 4 that will be like a very small odd but still that's weird and we need to research it so next up is me expertising gorgo this was the talent tree that i used for the field but it's not the best tree because the lost blue skill is bad you don't need it because you don't fight in field when you're under 30 percent of troops remain so get them to another blue or some stats that would be better. Um, we're, we're dueling and note that the enemy has not the best field march which would be like Nevsky Hua or Nevsky Joan um, but not this but it is a good reference though to measure how strong Gorgo is if we use the exact same opponent the whole time. So there we see a report 108 versus 243k Yikes, yeah that hurts. Let's move on to the next test. Uh, this was Leo Gorgo, it was probably the same. Um, but as you can see right here, point 0.2. So maybe I did have the armaments on, but no gear. That could be the case. I don't know for sure. But using an equipment on a testing would make things better in terms of uh, seeing how it would perform in the field. So that's not that bad actually. Um, let's switch the sets to Gorgo because we want to see her primary. And of course we switch gear, the same gear as we used on the Uche. New fight will be Gorgo Liu against the same enemy march. So. Uh, I don't know if he used gear, but if he didn't the whole time, it, it will be like the whole time. So uh, we could still see a percentual difference, although there might be percentage chance buffs that may have changed a little bit, right? So it looked like Gorgo smacked. It did 103 against 241, so that's actually a bit better. Like 2, 3k difference, so that, that's pretty insane. That's good, that's good. Um, for keeping in mind that Gorgo is a garrison. That That's weird though. Um, the difference isn't like that much, I just said it was insane, but it isn't that much actually. 2 or 3k kill points, which is like 200. Or 300 unit saps, that's that's not a lot. Um, next test is Liu with Sargon to use as a reference because Liu Sargon was the old, well, not old, it's like three weeks old, uh, old meta march for infantry, the, well, the best single march for a duo. Because you may say CPO Louis would be the best march, but if you're using three infantry marches, you would use definitely um, Sargon with CPO, uh, Liu with Gorgo, and Guan with Alex. That's what I'm using at least. Um, there may be some other interesting factors, um, but I don't own the. So let's compare this back. It seems like it's a 114k power difference here. And what was on the other report? 
uh, 135, 130, no, I'm miscalculating, 120, this is like 120, 24, it's actually more, like there's 120k power difference on the Liu Sargon uh, combination, while there's 140k power difference on um, Liu Gorgo, or what's the Gorgo Liu? I need to scroll back. So that's that's actually interesting. So this might be the single best infantry march in game. That's cool. So let's move on to the garrisons right now, also the rallies. So for this rally we do uh, Liu Sargon, which is the only march that was expertise from our side. We, we were just there with six people for maybe a bit more, but six to fives. Uh, so we couldn't really do the best rally pairs. Um, so we kept using this Liu Chess Sargon as reference material. Just like we did with the garrison here, which was Zeno Flavius. Um, as you can see, Liu Sargon quite beat this garrison, which was meta. Um, for infantry at least. But also... Like Flavius Scipius was also used. So we ran in this arc, we ran test without any equipment. Also, note that we used a garrison tree in here that wasn't optimal as well from my Gorgo, but from the other Gorgo, from the friend of mine, creator, his tree is almost perfect. Uh, it only misses like a bit. It was the field, it was the field tree that I used. I was I forgot to switch it okay so that's why mine isn't that good and we only tested against Nevsky Justinian and we tested with 420k troops every time because we didn't have enough people to fill uh, with tier 5s so it was we kept losing like this is not by much also if we think about the talent tree it wasn't the garrison talent tree, so if we use the right talent tree, we might break even or even get a good trade. So next up was my Leo Sargon again against Gorgo with, I guess, Zeno? Gorgo Zeno? Okay, let's speed it up. Yeah, okay, I saw. It was uh, Gorgo with Flavius. We needed to test that first because that was something we wouldn't really expect, right, to be very good. But it has beaten the rally, which is not an infantry main rally, but still, it is a good reference material, right? And this was the good tree from Pete. So we lost to about 20 K units here, which is pretty big. The next rally was the same rally, of course, of mine, and a garrison from Flavius with this time Gorgo's secondary. And it looks like the Gorgo has to be primary if you want to use it with Flavius, and we can see that back in the report as well. Um, I have a theory, and that's because that uh, Gorgo, her Active skill requires only 900 rage, which makes sense. It's dropping active skills then faster, because Flavius will cap it. The difference is uh, here about 140k, so it was significantly worse, okay? So we learned that we would need to use Gorgo as primary. In this clip, however, we try to do Zeno as primary and Gorgo as secondary. And it was quite surprising, and it performed pretty well, right? It it hold up. Um, and al also we tried Gorgo primary, Zeno secondary. So we needed to get to all options. We wanted to test Zeno, Flavius. Um, that was basically the most important. Uh, the difference, 160k. Still not better as the Fl is it Gorgo Flavius. Yeah, Gorgo Flavius. So this is their next rally and garrison. Here we had Gorgo Primer with a Zeno secondary against, uh, of course, the same rally as always. Um, and it performed quite well because it wasn't even red. So this difference right here, 
is about 230k, which is the best until now. Later we also tried Gorgo's CPO against this, the Justini, Nevsky Justinian rally, but it performed poorly, so that doesn't work. So the conclusion is that you would need to either run Gorgo with Flavius or Gorgo with Zeno. And if you want to be very anti-swarm, you want to be either Gorgo with Charles or Gorgo with Zeno. So what we see here is my Gorgo with Liuche's secondary and the field tree, because we use the field tree, against a Jan Ziska with a Hera secondary. It won by quite a lot. I don't have a report here sadly, so sorry about that, but you can even use her as a rally if you really need to. It's not the best, of course, it's not the best, it's not gonna be meta, but you can try. It's gonna be anti-swarm for sure if you do it with like Charles. Um, there may be a few other options that I have missed. So if you have seen this video, if you have questions, leave them down below. Please leave a like and subscribe, It would I would really love it. See you in the next one.